Dev and Ollie, Color Carnival. Introducing Dev, cheeky, clumsy, and very curious, a huge football fan. Ollie, Dev's magical bedtime owl, always eager to take off on adventures. Mum, wishes Dev would enjoy messy play. The girl, waits eagerly for the festival of colors every year. The other children, look mean at first, but are really just playful. It's painting class tomorrow, Mum reminded Dev as she kissed him goodnight. Dev groaned. He did not like any messy play. Painting, sand, muddy puddles. He ran away from them all, except football. I know just what will change your mind, said Ollie, Dev's magical bedtime owl. Come with me. Dev curiously hopped on board and off they went. Where are we going? asked Dev. To my favorite festival, Holy, where everyone covers each other in colors, replied Ollie. No way, yelled Dev. He tugged hard on Ollie's ears, trying to steer him back home. They continued to wrestle midair, so hard that Ollie's glasses fell off. Still battling, Dev slipped off and clung on to Ollie's neck. We're falling, spluttered Ollie. They finally landed with a bump, but in the wrong city. Now look what you've done. We were meant to be going to Delhi, but we've ended up in Agra, said Ollie. Never mind, Holy is celebrated across India. The whole country gets colored, exclaimed Dev. Well, not me. But it's fun. Look, said Ollie. From behind the tree, Dev saw people colored in different colors, dancing, singing, and playing. Everyone was enjoying themselves. Hey, you, called a girl's voice suddenly. Dev looked around, but couldn't see where the voice came from. Up here. What are you doing? asked the girl. Uh, watching, replied Dev. The girl jumped down and said, watching is not allowed. Help me. I'm in the middle of a water balloon fight with those kids. Before Dev could explain that he didn't like getting dirty, a water balloon hit him, and it was filled with paint. Ha ha, got you, laughed the other children. Don't mind them. Everything is fair when playing holy, said the girl. But Dev was furious. He picked up a water balloon and flung it across. That was fun, thought Dev, smiling for the first time. The other children sprayed Dev and the girl with their water pistols. I left mine up in the tree, said the girl. I'll get it for you, said Dev. He reached the water pistol easily, but got stuck on the way down. Hold tight, said the girl. The children slowly pushed a huge barrel of water beneath Dev. Okay, jump now, said the girl. But that water is murky, yelled Dev. You're already so mucky, chuckled Ollie. Dev finally jumped. Splash! Stepping out of the barrel, he slipped over, ending up covered in ashes. I can't get any dirtier, laughed Dev at last. Where did these ashes come from? The ashes are from the Holy Caban fire last night. That's how the Festival of Holy begins, said the girl. Years ago, people used to play with ashes from the bonfire to celebrate Holy. Aren't colors more fun? Let's go now. Together they ran into the crowd. Thank goodness, thought Ollie. Dev's finally joining in. When it came time to go home, Ollie tugged on a boy's shoulder. Hey, let go, said the boy. Uh-oh, said Ollie. Sorry, I mistook you for my friend Dev. Luckily, Ollie soon found Dev. You're so colored, I didn't even recognize you laughed Ollie. Dev gave Ollie a tight squeeze, and together they left Agra to head back home. Look below, Dev. It's the Taj Mahal, one of the greatest wonders of the world, said Ollie, gliding past. It's so white. Let's add some color to it, chuckled Dev. Oh, no. This is beautiful as it is, don't you think? asked Ollie. In the morning, when Mum entered Dev's room, she found him covered in paint. What have you done to your pajamas? cried Mum. Dev pulled out a painting. Mum gasped. Then, to Dev's surprise, she gave him a big hug. I'm so happy to finally see you enjoying painting, said Mum. Now, let's give you a good scrub. You're quite dirty. Not dirty, Mum. Colorful, smiled Dev. Ready for the painting class now? whispered Ollie. Can't wait, beamed Dev. And happy holy, Ollie.